Now, look, man, I must say this, man. I've always wanted to say this. Look, do you know the people who don't press the free like button on my videos are the same people that want to get kissed by Dean Ambrose? That is insane. I did the research. These are facts, right? These are the same people that told me that Dean Ambrose does not kiss men. They think that is the kiss of death. Oh, okay. Hmm. So by your logic, you want to get kissed by Dean Ambrose. You want him to give you the kiss of death. That's your logic, not mine. I think that is fruitcake stuff. But the people who don't press the free like button on my videos are the same people that co-sign wanting to be kissed by Dean Ambrose, another man. You people are weirdos, man. Holy shit. You people are just some of the most weirdest people I've ever known. What is up with these wrestling fans? It's like, how can you defend Dean Ambrose kissing other men? Look, man, these are the people who do press the free like button on my videos. They don't think that is the kiss of death. They think that is weirdo stuff. Those are the people who press the free like button on my videos. The people who don't believe Dean Ambrose does the kiss of death. So look, man, this video should be over 100 likes, man. Come on, man, at the least. Now, the truth has finally been revealed on why Brock Lesnar never wants to work with Kevin Owens. It's like, dude, I've been trying to hunt down this truth for the past four years. We finally know. And it has a lot to do with the upcoming All Elite Wrestling video game. Hmm. Somebody told me that Brock's move is actually on the game, right? People are telling me that the F5 is actually on the game, right? But they call it after Brock Lesnar's illness, right? I think it was called something Diverticus or something like that. Um, this is what I heard. I heard that that name goes way back. Um, I heard this name goes all the way back to the PWG days. And, oh my gosh, freaking S Caliber. He named the move. Let that sink in. He named the move, right? He called it the Deep Sea Diverticus or something like that. He named it after Brock Lesnar's illness, but he added Deep Sea so it won't be blatant. Look, I know I'm probably fucking botching the name. Look, man, that name is hard to say. Something died for the kids, something like that. But whatever Brock's thing was called when it came to his illness, yeah, they named it after him, which is weird. But Kevin Steen, he did the move, right? Um, I think Kevin Steen, Kevin Owens, he helped name that move. That is insane. I'm shocked. Nobody has put this puzzle together. Kevin Owens named the F5 after Brock Lesnar's illness. Hmm. That's why Brock Lesnar does not want to work with this guy. It has zero to do with his look. See, I thought it had something to do with his look, but I'm like, hold on, how? Look at Joe. Brock Lesnar worked with Samoa Joe. Brock Lesnar worked with a guy that had one leg. So, <laughs> Brock Lesnar don't care how you look. He wants to make money. But I'm shocked that Brock Lesnar found out about PWG. Um, so, look, if you go on YouTube, search the move, type in K 
Kevin Steen F5. And you can hear on commentary what they named that move. They named it after Brock Lesnar's near death illness. Look, I wouldn't be mad at all elite wrestling. No. Be mad at Kevin Steen. Be mad at Excalibur. Those two guys were the ones who named that move after Brock's near death illness. Let that sink in. Now, don't get it twisted. <laughs> Shit, I'm still going to play the game. So, here is another fact to back up my statements. Fun fact Sheldon Benjamin has never had a match with Kevin Owens. Let that sink in. Sheldon Benjamin is the best friend of Brock Lesnar. Those guys are family. Sheldon Benjamin, he is the godfather to Brock's kids. So, who wrestled for Ring of Honor? Sheldon Benjamin. Who wrestled for Ring of Honor at the same time as Kevin Steen? Sheldon Benjamin. Sheldon Benjamin was on the Indies for a long while. So, he knew what Kevin Steen was doing on the Indies. So obviously, Sheldon Benjamin was talking to Brock Lesnar. He was telling him what Kevin Steen was doing. Obviously, right? Those guys are best friends. Now, are you trying to piece the puzzles together? Sheldon Benjamin has never wrestled Kevin Owens. And I think we know why now. That's crazy how Sean Benjamin has been back with this company for the past like six years, right? And yet, he has never wrestled Kevin Owens. And I think we know why. Shit, I paid over 60 bucks for this game. I'm fucking playing it. I'm the fuck. It's like, I'm not going to use that move anyway. So, I don't care. But, I'm just giving you facts and evidence on why Brock does not want to work with Kevin Owens. It's because he used to do the F5 in PWG and he named it after Brock Lesnar's near death illness. I'm like, that's insane because did Kevin Owens think that that was funny? It's like, was it a shot? Or, I mean, what was they thinking by naming it after Brock's illness because around at that time Brock did not know who Kevin Steen was it's <laughs> like Brock Lesnar is not following PWG so I'm sure somebody told him that Kevin Steen was doing that move and naming it after Brock's illness now like I said don't blame all this on Excalibur it's 50-50 with him and Kevin Owens. It's crazy that nobody has brought this up until now. It's like, hold on. Kevin Owens, he's over. And that his PWG days was a long time ago. And I'm shocked nobody brought this up. I'm shocked that nobody made a big deal about this. Kevin... Kevin Steen named his move. He named the F5, right? Brock Lesnar is the maker of that move. He created that move. And you name his move after his near-death illness? I feel like, bro, that's tasteless, bro. <laughs> that is tasteless, man. I'm sorry, but it's, it's not comical. Like, that was real-life shit. And I'm just shocked that, look, man, PWG was and is a fucking joke, right? Listen, if I was Brock Lesnar, hell to the no, I'm not working with Kevin Owens. And if you look back at the history, Kevin Owens, like, I don't think he's ever had any offense on Brock Lesnar. <laughs> Brock Lesnar, every time they are in the same ring, Brock Lesnar is, is fucking whooping his ass. But they never really had a one-on-one -on -one match. 
and we all know why. See, when Brock does not want to work with you, he's not going to change, right? Look at Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt has been with this company since what, 2010? A long time. And yet Brock Lesnar has never worked with Bray Wyatt. You know why? Because he doesn't want to work with his supernatural bullshit. He doesn't, he doesn't want to be a part of Bray's supernatural storylines. That's why he keeps saying no to wrestling Bray Wyatt. And honestly, that's not going to change. When it comes to Kevin Steen, he's been with this company for a very long time. And yet Brock has not had not one one-on-one -on -one match with him. Now we know the real truth why Brock does not want to work with Kevin Owens. And I'm just, I'm, I'm shocked. People be sucking off Kevin Owens. And why are you giving him a hall pass? Hold on. Don't bash all elite wrestling. Seriously. Dude, this company was not around 10 years ago. Right? So I feel like they are, are not at fault. You have to blame the two people who named that move in the fucking first place. And that's Kevin Steen and Excalibur. It's like, man, I don't know how. Dude, this dude walks on water. Excalibur, this guy walks on water, man. This guy can say the fucking N-word. He can say all this dumb shit. He can make fun of people who are fucking retarded. He can say all these things and still be on TV. It's like, bro, there is YouTube. It's like all we got to do is go back and hear he was the guy who helped named the F5 after Brock's illness. All the fucking indies in PWG and Kevin Owens did the move multiple times. In fact, this guy did the move on AJ Styles. I swear to God, watch it. But look, I'm just trying to give you facts. I bring facts and evidence. I did tons of research on this topic because I always want to know how come Brock Lesnar does not want to work with Kevin Owens. Now we know it's because he named the F5 after his illness, which is tasteless, man. <laughs> that is hella tasteless. But don't get twisted. I'm still going to play the fucking game. Okay, I'm still going to say it. I'm still playing fight forever. I waited two years for this, man. Ain't nothing going to stop me. But I'm just giving you the news on why Brock never wants to work with Kevin Owens. This is Kevin Owens' fault and it's Excalibur's fault. That's it. I'm done.